uh, did you have that same feeling like this is going to work? Like our vibe is the same. Um, I didn't know. Uh, I started with him on the third record because he had one album, then he had room for squares and then he had, uh, you know, and the, the first album, I don't know anything about, I believe that heavier things was his third. Yeah. It's either his third or his second, you know, but I started on that album and that album was kind of sparse, you know, open sounding very open and um and very selective and orchestrated but once again to use the word in a very sparse way so i didn't feel uh, a free flow in creativity so much as how do we arrange this how can i contribute to that and uh also john has very specific ideas um, about what he wants at certain times. He'll let you flow if you want, if you insist on that, or if you say, yeah, I have something. Of course you can do, try it. But um, he's also very specific. And that existed even then. And that was in the early 2000s, 2002 or something like that. Mm -hmm. I remember the shadow of 9-11 was still hanging over New York at that time a little bit, not all the way. It wasn't casting the darkest shadow, but it def definitely changed the tone. So I still felt that a little bit. So I know it was, I think it was 2002 around when that was going on. Um, yeah. So I didn't quite feel the same free-flowing creativity, but there's a reason for that, you know, and it's a good one. 